Growing up in Thunder Bay in a skiing family, it was of little surprise that this future Olympian took to the snow at a young age. It was not long before he discovered the sport of ski jumping, taking to the hills of Big Thunder. A talented skier in both cross country and ski jumping, the sport of Nordic combined was perfectly suited to him, and in no time at all, he was bringing home the hardware. Claiming provincial honors in the early 1990s, he soon found himself competing against the best in the world. Representing Canada at the 1997 World Junior Nordic Ski Championships, this young 13-year-old gained valuable experience that he would take with him as he continued his athletic pursuits, going on to represent his country at many more events. During the warmer months, this dedicated young athlete continued to train, taking to the trails of his hometown, competing in cross-country running and cycling. With the closure of Big Thunder, Sean focused his attention on cross-country ski racing. Training hard, he brought home two medals in the juvenile division from his very first national competition. The following year, he was the overall national juvenile champion. Earning the opportunity to train at the National Team Development Center, Sean continued to develop his technique, competing in classic skate and sprint skiing. Serving as a member of the Canadian National Junior Team, he represented Canada at World Junior Ski Championships. In 2003, his 11th place showing in the sprints was one of the best ever by a Canadian male at a World Juniors. Back on home soil, he made it to the top of the podium, claiming junior gold and silver and finishing second overall at the 2002 Canadian Championships. He followed up the next season by claiming two gold and a silver and becoming the overall 2003 Junior Canadian Champion. Competing at the 2003 Canada Games in New Brunswick, he claimed gold in the sprints and helped Ontario earn a bronze medal in the team event. Ranked in the top five in NORAM distance races and a top three sprinter, his exceptional talents saw him advance to the Canadian Senior National Team, where he continued to represent Canada with distinction at races around the world. 2005 would prove to be another milestone season for this exceptional athlete, as he claimed the Canadian Sprint National Crown and competed in his first ever World Cup race, placing 28th in his debut in Vernon, BC. As the season progressed, he bettered his World Cup standing with a 13th place finish in the team sprint event. Over the course of the next five years, he represented Canada at races around the world, earning top 10 finishes at competitions throughout North America, Europe, and as far away as Japan and New Zealand. Earning a number of top 20 finishes in World Cup races, in 2007 he finished 13th overall in sprints and competed at the 2007 and 2009 World Championships. In 2006 he earned a coveted spot on the Canadian Olympic team. Travelling to Turin, he experienced an unwelcome delay in making his Olympic appearance. However, once he took to the course in the sprint qualifying race, he put in a strong performance. Less than a second shy of his personal goal, he finished just two spots away from advancing to the finals. Competing in the team 4x10 km relay, he helped Canada earn an 11th place Olympic finish. Continuing to dedicate himself to training and improving upon his performances over the next four years, he earned more podium placements, including gold and bronze medal finishes at the 2009 Canadian Championships. With his goal of making a return trip to the Olympic Games in his sights, a disappointing finish in the Olympic qualifying races saw him unable to attend the Vancouver Games. Rounding out his career with a national silver medal and having spent so much of his life devoted to his sport, in May of 2010, Sean decided it was time to focus his attention on other pursuits. Obtaining his undergraduate degree from the University of Calgary, he is currently pursuing his medical degree and starting a family. All throughout his career, Sean had the support of his family and the admiration of his community, who were all so very proud of his outstanding accomplishments and his incredible dedication to his sport.